if you'd like to see how I came up with this um, Dollar Tree family time shadow box DIY, just keep watching. Hello everyone and welcome. Today I bring you a DIY that is long overdue and it's with this um, shadow box. They sell at Dollar Tree. I'm sure you guys are all familiar. As well as stickers from the Dollar Tree. And I'm going to begin by opening up the shadow box. So we're just going to remove the plastic off of it. Okay, and um, I have this idea, and um, although it looks pretty like that, you could just take a picture and flip it under this little cute clothespin there. But um, yeah, I thought, why do it like that? Of course, this is me. And we'll do things differently. If you turn it around the back, you see there's two paper tapes, and they're black. Well, you take paper tapes and you peel it away. Like so. Put that all to the side. Take the other piece and do the same. Now this is just something that I thought up of and because I purchased these um frames thinking to myself that would be cute actually to put a cute little picture there. But then I when I got it home I was like mm. anyways this right here that you see here holding the clothespin, it's like a wire. Well, you took the tape off, the wire's right there, as you can see. You bend it forward, like so. Now, you pull it out. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And there you go. Okay, put that off to the side. Now you're left with this. It's a hole there, but you don't have to worry about that. Now the next step is picking out sticker. And it should look like that. Place that up on the top and it's not level, so let me fix it a little. Okay. So I got that out of this pack of stickers. Matter of fact, I think I'll take another sticker off of here. Hold on. And I think I want to go with this one. Okay. I think I'll take this one. Put the clock on here. And that's what I came up with. Let me see if I can pick the camera up. There you go. Now, you can add more to it if you want. Which is why I brought more sticker packs up. <laughs> I'm going to put this one away, because I don't want anything else from this sticker pack. Okay. Maybe something to embellish on the side, so let me see. So I bought all these stickers from the Dollar Tree, so I can do Dollar Tree DIYs, so... Yeah, I might as well. Oh, these corners would look nice, huh? Hmm. Maybe I'll try that. See how that looks. So, so far what I have here <laughs> is like family time. Get it? Mm -hmm. Okay, now let me just grab a hold of these stickers. And there you go. And I'll take the other piece and put it on the other side. Here we go. Oh, if it touches, that'll be nice. Okay. Am I in shot? There you go. Okay. I need the camera. Darn, hold on. <laughs> Alright. So far, that is my little shadow box. And you can do this with so many other stickers. We have picked up so many of these. My first idea was doing a coffee theme and then doing another one with a tea theme for my dining room. But for now, this is what we have. 
and this is my Dollar Tree DIY shadow box. Simple yet elegant. Because I kept repositioning, see the stickers coming down? And that's because I kept repositioning it. So, and that is what happened. Mm hmm. Okay, so if that happens to you, they sell this at the Dollar Tree also, and it's in mounting pads. Hold on. And it comes 24 in a pack, and they're called mounting pads, and they look like this. Oh, and you take it out the package. Hold on. You open up the package, of course. You take one out. It'll have this paper. Peel it off, both ends. I might have a little paper stuck. You just take that. And that's what these are. These little pads. That's what they are. So you just take one. Place it there. And I'm going to place two. Just for security. Take another one out. Take that piece of paper off. And peel the paper backing off. And position that one right beside that one. I don't want to rip the other ones off because I'm afraid of the whole sticker getting destroyed. So there you go. Only thing these stick out more. They're thicker, if you can see. So you're going to get more of that 3D effect. So then you carefully reposition. And voila. It will fall down no more. So remember that if you come across that or they come loose, pick these up from the Dollar Tree. They are called the mounting pads. And should be 24 in a pack. They look like this. Very handy. Um, so yeah, and that's how mine looks. Elegant. Yet yeah, simple, yet yeah, pretty. And thanks to my husband, this is the final result of the DIY. He hung it up for me here in the living room, underneath the family frame we have here over the TV. Thank you, honey. You're welcome, dear. So yeah, isn't it nice? Something you make with your own little hands. Stuff from the Dollar Tree. Simple, yet elegant, and nice touch. So, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you try this DIY out if you have the materials, like the shadow box. So you could do it with any frame, actually. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. May God continue to bless you and everyone you love always. Until next time, may you all stay blessed, beautiful, and ciao.